Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to enable always on display on the Realme 14C. Alright, so let's begin. So first we need to open up the settings in here. Scroll down a little bit and click on, oh sorry, click on wallpapers and style. And here Below we have the always on display feature, simply click on that, make sure it's enabled right in here. Okay, in here we can select the mode, we have the seamless or the classic. Below we can change the display settings, we can enable the notifi new notifications, so the new notification will be shown on the always on display. Next to it we have time, date, battery and notifications. And in here you can select or unselect the things that you want on your screen. So we can enable the time, also the date, the battery percentage and the notifications. You can see that they appear right in here. All right, but it's up to you which style you select. All right, below we have our recent AOD styles. In here we can also change the text color. You can see that they are changing. If you want to change it, simply click on apply. All right, below we also have the personalized ones. We have the Bitmoji, but you need to install it from the Play Store. Next to it we have the custom patterns. We can draw it. We have the paintbrush right in here. We can adjust its thickness also, but only on the first option. We can also click on random to generate random one. We can also click on shape and change the shapes right in here as you can see. But now let's draw the pattern using our finger and you can see that it's appearing right now on the screen. If you want to stop drawing simply release your finger and then click on done if you want to save it but you can also click on clear to start again. So simply draw, I'll leave it just like it is now then click on done and now as you can see our shape has appeared above the clock. Then click on apply and now it's enabled. Let's see how this looks. Sorry, it's right in here. So you can see that the color is good. The one that I have just set and also the shape above it. All right, now let's get back to the settings. Next to it, we also have the text. In here you can basically type anything that you want, it will appear above the clock. You can see that it's appearing right now on the screen. You can adjust also its size, also its color, the weight of it. You can see the difference on the screen right now. Also the alignment we have a few options that we can adjust to our preferences and below we have the character spacing and also the line spacing. So now let's click on apply and let's see how this works. We you, can you can see that it has been successfully set. All right. But for now I'm gonna use that one. There's also the text and image. We need to click on agree and continue. I'll use my screenshot that I have taken by misclick. Okay, let it be right in here. Click on apply. And let's see, does it work? As you can see, our screenshot appeared right in here. So it also works. But I'm gonna 
apply this one again. Below also under this system we have the carbon footprint. You can read what this option does below. And click on got it. In here we have three three images that we can select and again the color of the text. So let's say I'll select this one. I want the blue font. Click on apply. And now let's see. As you can see it works and it has been successfully set. Next to it it's homeland. Click on got it. And here again we have three other styles. You can see them above. And also there is insights. You can see how this works. Actually how this looks like. Then we have the digital clock, analog clock, realme O, edge clock and the image. But I'll leave it to you how and I just leave it to you to find it by yourself and se select the thing that you are interested in the most. Alright, that's all in this video. Thank you all for watching. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment and subscribe.